All right, what is going on, guys? Today we are watching the finale of Call of the Night, episode thirteen of this season. Um, I'm excited to see what's going to happen here now with uh, the kind of the detective after what she did in the last episode, which was very bold. Um, it also ended off the episode with Co chilling in the park, and um, he met up with the other vampire, which we haven't kind of spoke to yet. We've kind of got to know the other ones. Um, a bit more, but I don't think well, there, might, there might be another one after this as well. But um, yeah, that was very interesting that she's going to show up now. So I'm excited for this finale episode. I want to thank you guys for watching this season along with me this ep uh, this season. I really appreciate it. Uh, hopefully, we get a season two announcement. Um, but I'd happily, happily watch that. Um, but yeah, let's go into this episode right now. Oh, it's sad to think that this is all Nazna does now, just game all day because she's just kind of bored of being alive. Is this a vampire family or? What the hell is going on right now? Are they like fans or something? What is this? Bro, that girl really ripped out her own hair, yeah. Damn, this makes Nazna's, Nazna's apartment look like trash. Yeah, I suppose they could be men and women. Isn't one of them supposed to be like an idol or something? Or did I, did I make that up? Is this supposed to be her? You're gonna invite me over to your house, then go shower? Like, bro, what do you want? Bro, is you naked? Yeah. Is that dude? <laughs> You're looking for a little bit too long there, bro. Well, you fooled me. <laughs> Bro, take your time. I mean, it's not like he was into her, so what's the big deal? Is this the first male vampire? Apart from that dude that just got smoked. Definitely has a female voice actor, so they were really going in on that. I mean, he'd never say anything. Like, he's cool like that. Oh, you're just gonna ruin the whole party, yeah? <laughs> I was gonna drink that. Nazan is a bad bitch. Bro, Nazana will fuck you up. <laughs> That's bad. That's so lame. <laughs> she has some kind of poison in her blood or something, but what kind of creature would have that? Vampires don't know much about vampires? Interesting. Very true, yeah. We know enough, but... They don't research into themselves, I suppose. <laughs> Can I try it? We don't need someone else getting addicted to your blood, bro. Bro, this is going to be a different kind of awakening for Ko. Because I look good that way. Yeah, fair enough. <laughs> like what they do or someone's making them do it. I'd actually like to hear about the uh, the vampires that turn these guys into vampires. That'd, be, that'd come with a bit more development, I suppose. 
Mm, there's no specific rule, that's just kind of what the redhead woman is going off. The best thing to do would be to kill him. Wait, how is he? He's not going to fall in love with you. Bro, he's struggling to fall in love with fucking Nazana, never mind you. <laughs> I don't mind that. Interesting. He's a very complex character. He doesn't... He have a cute face. <laughs> so maybe he's like... Sometimes he gives off aromantic vibes, asexual vibes, pansexual vibes. Quite complex of a character. I like him. I don't think he can. There's only one person for him, honestly. Yo. Is that possible? Oh, so those people are the offspring. So she can basically, or he, he can basically force someone to be an offspring. Wow. Let's go, Ko. He's so fucking cool, man. There's good music playing right now. Let's go. Ko's got some balls on him, to be honest. Oh, this music's nice. Let's go. Yeah, and you know she is. But being around him, it's different. God, I love the vibes of this anime. The colours and the music have just slapped all season. Uh, where's Nazna? Oh, shit, what happened? <laughs> Let's go, Ko. I'm thinking that she didn't actually hurt her. I reckon they just had some conversation about love or something. And that's what happened. No, get lost. Boy, where are you going? That's gonna break your legs. Okay, that was a big ass jump, dude. How'd you not break your legs? <laughs> oh, all the people they've met through the anime? Who are you? Is that the um, old boy's girl? Like the older woman? She's either really tired or she's a vampire. Yeah. They didn't fight. They didn't physically fight. <laughs> oh, I love this. Like their first meeting. Bro, the fact that he snuck up on her. They definitely had some lovey-dovey talk. Oh, she definitely looks fine with her hair down. Yeah. I want to hear what she, what Nazna actually said to her. Come on, say it back, Nazna. Come on. Oh. She was going to say something else there, though. These two are so sweet. Bro, get your beer out the vending machine. <laughs> Let's go. Ko's a fucking good character, man. Music's great, too. Oh, let's go. Bro, this is so good. Fucking 10 out of 10 episode. Bro, I'm tearing up here, man. That was Call of the Night episode 13, the finale of the season. Damn, that was a freaking good ending. Music uh, on top of the kind of scene on the roof. Um, 
uh, well as yeah as well as uh, co talking to girl that we we've now realized is a dude uh, music was great there uh, on the bridge too and then in this final part there with the kiss sealed it such a nice uh, ending to a first season of a rom-com um i love them i love these guys so much even the vampire girls ship them so yeah uh, i'm excited hopefully we get a season two um I, d I don't know how much content there is in the manga um but you guys, you guys let me know if there's enough for season two so i can hope and dream uh, unless one has already been revealed i don't know nothing was revealed at the end there so we will see but yeah uh really enjoyed it this season call of the night's been friggin awesome the style the music the colors the story, the relationship and chemistry between Ko and Nazna has been perfect. I loved it so much. Um, and yeah, very excited for more in the future. Anyway, guys, I want to thank you guys so much for watching my reaction. Have a nice rest of your day and peace out. <laughs>